For this year's SDCC, Funko is releasing 40 plus new items, mostly Funko Pops, mostly Solas, but if you're also a Loungefly fan, you also have many other new SDCC related items coming as well, which means there is something for everybody. And if you're wondering when this will happen, well, shared exclusives will be available to all on Thursday, July 21st. Items will also be available via Funko.com and via the Funko headquarters at Everett and Hollywood. Also, there won't be a lottery to purchase exclusives on Funko.com. Now, if you're also attending SDCC, Funko will be setting up a neighborhood called Funkoville with booths, live stream, games, and giveaways. Funko Fun Days is also back and will be happening on Friday, July 22nd, and the theme is Blacklight. Fun day tickets are separate tickets not connected to the SDCC tickets. They will cost $150 and is limited to two per customer. Fun day tickets will also go on sale Tuesday, June 21st at random times between 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific. Also, fun day ticket holders attendees is restricted to one box of fun. Now for everything that will be available, starting off with anime. We have from the Attack on Titan, Queen Historia, Boruto, we have Chocho from Dragon Ball Z, we have Goku, who's doing his driving exam, from Jujutsu Kaisen, we have Yuki Itadori with Slaughter Demon, we have also from Demon Slayer, Enmu, then from My Hero Academia, we have Gran Torino, and also from My Hero Academia, we have a skateboard deck of Deku. From Marvel, we have Spider-Man Gamerverse, Spider-Man 2099. We have from Loki, He Who Remains, as well as a glow-in-the-dark version of Miss Minutes. From Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness, we have America Chavez. We also have Marvel Silk. We also have Moon Knight, Scarlet Scarab. From Star Wars, we have Flocked Karsantan. I won't pretend to even try to pronounce that correctly. I know I butchered it. I am sorry. We also have Cassian Andor and we have Purge Trooper. From Ad Icons, we have the SDCC Toucan with Guitar and Toucan Pirate. From Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, we have some Power Ranger crossovers. We have Donatello as Black Ranger and Leonardo as Blue Ranger. And then for every other Funko Pops, we have Peacemaker with Peace Sign. We also have from the Squid Game, Young He Doll 6-inch version. Glow in the Dark Demi Gorgon. We also have Ted Lasso. Then from South Park, we have Digital Stan Glow in the Dark. Pokemon, we have Charmander, which is a metallic version. We have from Batman Return Rides, the Penguin and Duck Ride, which I believe there are other ride versions of these already out. We also have G.I. Joe, Serpentor, as well as from Transformers, we have Unicorn, Jumbo. From Disney Classics, we have Bambi. From Justice Leagues, we have Starfire. From Friends, we have Hugsy the Penguin. As well as from Masters of the Universe, we have He-Man. From Parks and Recs, we have Jeremy Jam. And from Sonic the Hedgehog, we have Super Sonic First Appearance Glow in the Dark. For Funko Sodas, we have from DC Comics, we have Lar. Fleas. We have from Fantastic Plastic, we have Otto. Then we have Guardians of the Galaxy with Star Lord. From Hanna Barbera of Sodas, we have Huckleberry Hound. Then from Lord of the Rings, we have Bilbo Baggins. And we also have from Virtual Singer, Hatsune Miku. And for the Loungefly fans, we have Stranger Things, Glow in the Dark, Demi Gorgon. We also have Corpse's Bride, Glow in the Dark, Carl from Up, as well as Zowu, which is a light up bag. We also have from Star Wars, Star Wars Tuxen Raider, then Lewis Glow in the Dark, then Stitch Skeleton, which is a Glow in the Dark as well. Then from Marvel, we have Gamora, Gamora, as well as Captain Carter. And we have a Funko shirt. And if you're wondering where you can find everything, here's a quick look for everything outside of the US. However, we did not have anything for Canada. So it's 
kind of up in the air where everything is going to be. Hopefully they update it very soon and we'll know as Canadians where we can find things. But Hot Topic and GameStop normally has the same thing as US. Everything else I'm not quite sure about. Sometimes, most of the time, Toys R Us normally gets items. So hopefully they get the bulk of everything else that is left and you can find it. And if you enjoyed and appreciated this video and all the information that is in it, I would mega appreciate a like as well as a subscribe if you're brand new. I'm Ricardo, also known as a Pop Patrol. Until next time, bye for now.